Santa. New Year's doing grammar school. Let's find out with Mr Mitchell what's been happening our first week back. <laughs> Happy New Year, Mr Mitchell. Happy New Year to both of you too. Um, what's your New Year's resolution? My New Year resolution is to get fitter and uh, start eating a bit healthier and um, try and lose some of this weight that I've got. So that's my New Year resolution. And what's your New Year's resolution for the school? I think to increase our um, attainment and achievement levels um, and hopefully really push the bar out this year, mm. um, which is something that we're really going to try and drive for. What's the highlight of this week been for you? I think just before I start talking about, about the highlight, I would just like to wish everyone a, a really happy new year and wish everyone ve um, all the best for, for 2018. I'd like to thank everyone for viewing the vlog so far, um, and I hope you're finding it informative and enjoying um, hearing about the news from Darun Grammar School. And as you can see, the first vlog of this year um, is now in our new assembly room, um, which is going to be a great addition to our school community. And I'd just also like to say that we ended uh, last term on a real high, um, where our pupil talent show was just amazing. We had pupil, a number of pupils taking part, um, and we had singing, dancing, piping, football skills, uh, and it was just great. And well done to, to Milton House, who won the competition um, and added points to their, their house total. And the afternoon of the last day, again, was a real treat when a, a large number of our staff took part um, in DGS Does Strictly, um, and it was just brilliant. And well done to Mr Johnston and the P department who, who won that. But a big thank you to Mr McNeilidge who, who coordinated um, that whole event. And kind of moving on to this week, it's just great being back at school. Um, and as you know, you're just about all our seniors are preparing for their exams right now, uh, the prelim exams. So there's a big drive for that. And um, obviously the prelim examination timetable you were issued with, um, but there's a copy on our website and um, on our Facebook page. So on Monday, our uh, staff were given a, a session on the new standardised assessment, which the Scottish Government have introduced, so that they were just given an, a brief overview of that. Um, and on Wednesday, as you know, Brian Costello was in. Brian's a uh, founder of the company Headstrong, and he's going to be working with all our pupils over the next uh, three or four months. And he gave really interesting, thought-provoking presentations to our S3 to S6 pupils. Um, and Brian's going to be working with us until June, as I said. Um, and hopefully he'll going to be preparing you for your examinations um, and getting you in the right frame of mind for that. Um, house time this, this week and next week um, has been split. The juniors are moving into one class and the seniors are moving into to one class, and that's going to allow our seniors um, additional um, 35 minutes to study in school. And this weekend we're holding our stud first study weekend of the year. Um, and again, a, a programme was put onto our Facebook page and our website, um, and pupils have a hard copy. But um, on Sunday, Saturday the 13th and Sunday the 14th, there are a number of inputs available, um, and the sessions start at half nine um, and finish at four o'clock um, on both days. So please encourage your sons or daughters to sign up if they haven't already done so. And what's next week got in store for us? OK, next week, Brian Costello is back in, in school with us and he's going to be working with our S2 pupils, um, doing a workshop with them on Monday afternoon. And then he's going to be offering a parental workshop uh, presentation um, at six o'clock on Monday night um, in the new assembly room. Um, and it, although it's going to be focused in on S3 to S6, really preparing young people for exams, all parents are invited along um, to, to hear that input and it would be very worthwhile um, to, to, to make that attempt to get along. On Wednesday, we hold our second Primary 7 information evening, um, and it starts at 7 o'clock, and it will be in the school forum. Um, I issued out uh, the January news flash. Um, I emailed it out to parents and carers, but a copy can be found on our website and on our Facebook page also. And as I said, our prelims start next week. Um, so on Monday, we have National 5 Higher and Advanced Higher Maths. On Tuesday, it's National 5 and Higher Modern Studies, National 5 Practical Woodworking and National 5 Music Listening. And on Wednesday, it's National 5 Higher and Advanced Higher Chemistry, National 5 Hospitality and, National, and Higher Music Performing. On Thursday, Business Management at National 5 and Higher and Graphic Communication at Higher and Advanced Higher. And on Friday, it's National 5 Drama and National 5 Graphic Communication. Thank you very much for speaking to us, and we hope you have a great 2018. You're welcome.